About what, an NBA? NBA what? Oh, I'm glad you talk about because I got some shit we need to talk about. But the NBA is not that bad. Yo, my Knicks, bro, we is up. Ooh, we I is, hate Nick fan. We is up, I don't up, like bro. to use the word hate. But Nick fan, I greatly dislike y'all, motherfuckers. Why? The most, like, stupid people are Nick fans. No. Y'all, we're just, the, y'all just can't think clear. Like, we are the most, we're the most loyal fan base. We, no, you're I, not. I've been there through the trenches, my Okay, all right, but look, though. When Pablo Prigioni was our point guard, I was still watching the Knicks. going crazy, though. Nick, I, I don't want to watch this 35-year-old <laughs> rookie. What the f***? All right, but look, though. This is what y'all do. Y'all, y'all embrace a player, right, yeah. when he's doing well. As soon as that player does bad, he is the worst player ever. Oh, I mean, it's New York. You know how they are. We do the same. No, no. There's New York fans from New Mexico. They all, <laughs> they, they, all of y'all the same way. I don't know why it is. It's really got to say where well, y'all, y'all eat somebody and spit them out. Literally. I mean, I, I don't do that. I understand. Nah, I be hating on this. I do. That, that's that's a part of it. I like, do be hating on That's niggas. a part of it. You could just get rid of this person. We'll be so... No, embrace your team. <laughs> like, it's like, but when I hate on this, they be good. Like, RJ Barrett, I hated on him the first year. Look at him now. He going crazy. See, bro, he hears me, bro. That's the Nick mentality. He hears now, me. Now, all of a sudden, you like this guy. <laughs> no. What happened to two months ago when you didn't like him? Bro, it's the media's fault. They was talking oh. about KD, Kyrie, and Zion. And we got RJ Barrett and, I mean, Julius Randle. I'll, I'll take Julius Randle. Now you would. I remember we had a conversation. Oh, you fuck. said, he don't deserve that money. <laughs> he's not that good. Look what he's doing. I didn't forget. But it always is better at the end. Remember when I was hating on Alonzo? Look at him now. Bro, you, that's, was, that's that Nick mentality. The first thing y'all do is look at what's bad. In each player. Let's so, stay on the Knicks. Do you uh, like, like, do you understand like how bad we were? Yes, I do. Like but it I was also horrible. What, how good you guys were too for those. Yeah, like, but three I wasn't. Years. I wasn't uh, like watching at the time when we was that good. Wait, when when Melo was there? Oh no, I'm thinking about like Patrick Ewing. Like it wasn't even. We was like five. It, no, I'm lying. We was not even born. We was probably one year. One two years one, old. One two years old. But. Freaking like now, nah, mellow like them three years. That was good years, but then it just dropped off somehow. I don't know what the f- happened. No, <clears throat> y'all stop believing him, which Nick fans do, and just spit him out. Oh man, but you know what? Bro? It's just it's just the atmosphere, bro. Like, we the East Coast, bro. But no, that's not true because us Boston Celtics fans don't do that to Boston Celtics. Like we got mad when it was traded. Like, we like, yo, how could y'all do that? Melo got traded. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah. Like, who does that? Who does that? Somebody put the all into your team, and y'all celebrate that he gets traded. I don't know, bro. We was hurt that Isaiah Thomas was traded. That's tough. Hurt. When I there's trade rumors, as a Celtic fan, we get hurt. Like, yo, how could they dare do this? So you're going to be hurt when Jalen Brown gets traded? Jalen Brown's not getting traded. For Bradley Bill. Would you do that? No. Keep the Keep the... Yeah, I think y'all gonna win with. All right, I think y'all be good if Jalen Brown has like a big leap, even bigger than what he had last year. He had a huge leap. Yeah, he had a huge leap, but he got hurt. Well, so if he stays, the, the problem is not with Jalen Brown. Yeah, I don't got no point guard. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. Marcus Smart running the one. How you feel about that? Marcus Smart is originally a point guard. I know, but like, I wouldn't want him running my number one. I'm not gonna lie. The only reason I would say that is because he put so much effort on defense. He tired bringing the ball up. That's the, that's the only thing. But yeah, aside from that, he ain't the best playmaker. He's not the, the world. He's not a playmaker at all. Wait, we just got um Dennis Schroeder. We, yeah, we got Dennis Schroeder. We got Peyton Pritchard, who's pretty promising. He tough. He's tough. That's what I'm saying. Like man. 92 in the fuck. What's it called? And that was that the Jamal Crawford shit. Or yeah, was it, something else? It, no, it was another league. But it was him and uh, I think Mike James. <laughs> Yeah, them niggas going yeah, off. That nigga had like 70. That's max. That's what I'm saying. Niggas go hoop, bro. So don't don't sleep on that boy. I'm not, bro. I'm not. Hey, but we took your guy from you, bro. We'll take Kemba. Which guy? We'll take Kemba. Kemba? <laughs> don't hate on him. You look. Like, what you I, but look, though. But look, though. Because I was one of those people, right? When, uh. I hated on Kemba. Now I'm happy. You're a Knicks fan. She's saying something that I'm surprised about. But look, though. <laughs> I was one of those people. When, we, when Kyrie left, right? And we got Kemba. I'm like, that's fine. Yeah. Because years prior, Kimba and Kyrie's numbers was like this. He was all NBA that year. I think yeah, first yeah. team. That's what I'm saying. Kimba and Kyrie's numbers was like so, the same. Yeah, it was like pretty much the same. But He just got hurt. Yeah, and it kind of ruined his career. <laughs> <laughs> I think he's going to be good. I mean, he was he was averaging like 20. 
for y'all, but it was force like... Force of 20. Force of 20, very yeah, force that's of, what Very I'm bad efficiency. Like, like, is it really a 20? Because if it goes, he goes somewhere else, is it still going to be 20? Oh, we'll see. In the, is it, and why? Is it going to be 20? It's I mean, he playing back 15, at home. 16. He playing back at home. I think he got something to improve. Especially that ball is for Julius Randle right now. Oh, yeah, it does. That's his home. That ball is for Julius Randle. Like, he... He got it, bro. He got the respect. Mm-hmm. He got the respect. I didn't think he was going to be like this. But at the same time, they locked him up in the playoffs. They did. They clamped my boy. Because all he could do, he could only go left. I don't know. Do the Ivy. Just go that same way stronger. <laughs> <laughs> go that same way stronger, bro. And we just need another nigga that could score the ball. Like, RJ could score, but it's not like he going to get you a bucket like that. Like, off the dribble touch. Yeah, he just, like, oh. catch and shoot. Derrick Rose was doing well. Derrick Rose was doing very well. But, like, Derrick Rose. I don't know what it is. Maybe I need another star, quote, unquote. But, like, I don't think Kimba's that guy. I don't think so. I don't so think either. I made a big leap grabbing Kemba. You think yeah. we'll be in the playoffs? Oh, for sure, hundred percent. Like what seed? That's I think uh, like five, five to eight range. Lowest eight, highest like four. Lowest not eight. They're not gonna be eight seed. You don't think so? Mm-mm. I'm like I'm seven, just seven just in case. I'm oh, just wow. just in case. A realistic Nick fan. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, Yo. No, eight eight is way too long. Seven. No, I'm not uh, yeah, I can see seven though. Like I see them slipping to seven because of injury. That makes sense. Yeah, I think the you think the Hornets gonna make the playoffs. They almost did it though. With I that, say playing the playing the playing shit. Yeah, I say nine. No, but they got a little roster now, and I heard they're looking for Boogie. So but they, Boogie, I don't know what's good with Boogie, but he's like that washed. was one of the best centers. He's number I've one for two years, years, like fifteen, two thousand fifteen, two thousand sixteen, two thousand seven, seventeen ish. I think that's when he got hurt, but like that mm-hmm. time he was the best center, one of the best centers. The best center in the league. Like he was doing everything that I say. You know how Embiid is good at scoring the ball. Yeah. And then you got Jokic good at passing the ball, a little bit of scoring. And then and then the B got a little bit of defense. Yeah. He had everything. Now nah, he did have everything. He had everything you need, bro. He was like cat with like dribble moves and like the size of Joel and oh, He was like three fifty putting the ball down. He 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 he. Pull up. Like, come on now, bro. That was tough. The best center. Nah. But hold on. I got a question for you, bro. What's the word? Who do you think is the most hated players in the NBA? Hated players? Like, hated. By, like, media, people, fans. My favorite player, Russell Westbrook. I agree. They hate on him so bad. So I feel much. so bad. And it's like, he can't... Unless he's doing well, he doesn't get the credit he deserves. No, he don't. He don't get... Nowhere near the praise. Averaging a triple player. double from him is it's like, called easy. It's easy. It's called a uh, uh, stat pattern. Like if it was easy, everyone would do it. If it was easy, LeBron would do it. But his energy is always up. Like, it's always up. It's always a hundred percent. They always talk about he can't shoot, and like players the like way him. He, the way his game is, he got he's getting the LeBron treatment. Before, not saying like he's LeBron status or as good as LeBron, but the LeBron treatment that they were always looking for. Somewhere or something in his game to critique and say this is bad, yeah. or someone or the way he talks, they call him a bad teammate. When every single one of his teammates, except Kevin Durant, will say like he is one of the best teammates I ever. Worked I know with. it's just the way he is. They everybody thinks he's a bad guy, but he's really yeah, not. Yeah. He's a cool dude, and that's why he's one of my favorite because him being so misunderstood, but by the passion though, like his passion make people think like he crazy or he don't like people or he angry. Nah. No, it's called passion. It's called either get with me or get out of the way. <laughs> you feel me? You know who I think is also hated on? Hmm. John Wall. John Wall don't get no damn hate. Bro. John, he he's too hurt to get some hate. I feel like he I feel like he did good this year. He had like what, twenty? But he's just on a really bad team. And nobody ever talks about him like that. John Wall did I right. I think he I don't even think he had twenty, bro. I think it was like twenty or nineteen. Yeah, like 20, 19, 18. But yeah, coming back, 18. he tore what you, he tore his Achilles like twice or some shit, yeah, or like his knee. <laughs> nigga was, I don't know what the fuck he was doing. Yeah. Nigga said he slipped in his house. I'm not. I don't believe that. <laughs> I don't believe that shit at all, yeah. bro. That's a damn lie, bro. Slipping in your house, you tear your Achilles. Like no, nah, bro. That nigga was awesome shit, bro. All right, here's another name I got. <sighs> it's hard to say this one. Everybody say everybody hate on Ben Simmons. Oh no, nah. um. I don't hate on Ben. I don't either. I don't hate on Ben. I actually like Ben Simmons. Yeah. It's just the team that's around him. It's the team. Philly is good, but. They don't need a Nick. I mean, I'm not saying they don't need him, but it's like they need someone of a different caliber as him. Mm-hmm. 
But he, yo, six ten point guard could defend everything. All he could, the only thing he can't do is shoot the ball. I feel like he just. I don't know what it is. Also, people don't ever look at the mental aspect of basketball. Oh, they never do. Like how it's ninety percent mental. Yeah, how it takes a toll on people. So you think they're ignoring everything that's being said in the media? So now he could have that open shot. Now he don't want to take it. Yeah, because he's afraid. Because he's afraid of what. As soon as he even takes a jump shot, it's gonna blow up on Sports Center. I know, like a, like a he, joke. Yeah, like a joke. Whether he makes it or, or miss it, but he want to be great so bad that that stuff will bother him. So that's what it makes bother him. And then you come in where, right, Doc when he first he, when he first even got to Philly, yeah, he said that um, I don't need Ben Simmons to shoot. I know. Now all of a sudden you switch up on bro, it's crazy. That's why. I understand where Ben is coming from. He don't want to talk to nobody. Yeah. He don't want to be at no practice. He, I heard he not going to the... Um, I heard he left Philly. The camp. Yeah. Like, he just dipped. Not mad at him, bro. I'm not mad at him. I think he needs to go to a new place. Like, start off fresh. He goes to the Warriors. Yeah, but niggas is asking for Steph Curry. <laughs> like, what? Because nah, niggas high, yo? But nah, they was asking for picks. They hold picks. All of their picks. They was asking for all their first rounds. Plus Andrew Wiggins, like they wanted a lot for Ben Simmons. Even though Ben Simmons will be worth a lot, the niggas our age. I know. Mate, was no, I think he's like twenty. I think he turns twenty five. I think he's a little older than us. Nah, bro, he's like tw- like twenty four, maybe. Yeah, twenty four. He's he's not he's not like he's a little older than us, but he's like cause I know he graduated what two thousand fifteen. Fifteen or sixteen. So he's like two years older than us, maybe. That's what I'm saying. Like, what team you think he should be on though? I, I would like him on the Warriors is tough though. On the Warriors would look real good. That look, yo, his assist, bro. Yeah, he's Draymond Green on steroids. On steroids, bro. Super athletic. Six super ele- lengthy. Six eleven, bro. Could dribble the ball, pass the ball, go and dunk the ball like Giannis, but he just choose not to. Mm-hmm. He, that's really it. like there was a game he played against the the Jazz. He had like forty two off of straight dunks. Dunks. Like Giannis, bro. Like if he re- like Philly, don't know what they messed up with, not being loyal. Hey man. You got you got any more you think? Oh, I have another one. Uh, Paul George, you think he's hating on? He brought it upon himself. He did. I think he did too. That he tried to be all cool and shit, talking about a playoff P. Niggas <laughs> 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 got on his ass. They got on his ass. He wanted to be playoff P. Nah, nigga called him pandemic P. Pandemic P. Like, <laughs> the media didn't make the name playoff P. He made that name, so he put that on himself type shit. Like, yeah. Nah. Like, but he's been doing good this playoffs though. Like last playoffs, he was all right without Kawhi. He did he did do okay. Like he was holding his own. But they needed Kawhi. They did. Like, I don't know why Kawhi be so is so good, bro. Like it yeah. don't seem like he that nice it for don't. real. Don't. Like he do basic dribble moves yeah, like straight cr- play like his an old speed nigga. on his time. He played like he played like he's in the seventies type shit. Oh no god, he don't bro. break nobody down. He just it's just a one dribble his pull- spot. The easiest, Yo. like it don't see, like yeah. you don't got no. It's weird. It's weird. He just take his time. Like I be hearing niggas talk about Kawhi top five player in the NBA. Nah, I mean, nah. Who's it? was it? Fred Buddies. All right, we'll go to this. Is Giannis top three in the NBA? Mm. Even though he just won NBA championship, he just won MVP, Defensive Player of the Year. I don't. I'll I'll give it to him. I'll give it to him top three. I'll let. I'll, so who's your top three? Uh, KD, Steph, and Giannis. Do you Respectful. Know who LeBron James is? I don't know. It's like it's like the three and four spot. Like I feel like it's either Steph Curry. Like are you talking about in general or just this year? Even this year, because Steph Curry had a crazy year. Nigga on average like thirty three, but his team was just ass. He had a crazy year though. I would say that. Like, if anything, like, the highest I have LeBron is, like, two. But the lowest I have him is four. But it's just, like... To be honest, right now, is better than LeBron James. As of right now, what he did in the finals, yeah. I think so. I actually do think so. I'm not going to lie. Overall, no. But, like, after this year, like, if LeBron don't... I think LeBron still got it for another, like, two, three years, max. And that, I mean, like, prime, prime. Like, like at the top of his game... Maybe two years, and then that's when you start seeing like him 
going down like from about 20. To be 37. I know. That's really crazy, bro. And you telling he got two years at the prime? That's, like, that's what I'm... Crazy. Now, I believe that Giannis is the worst best player that we've ever seen. Why you say worst best player? I think he ain't got no skill. <laughs> he has no skill. Barely he can't he can't break nobody down. He's just like raw athleticism, raw speed. Like it's like his I, natural God given abilities is what's making him so great. But they said the same thing about Shaq. Shaq had a nice jump hook. Shaq, Shaq would just but he wouldn't use it all the time. Yes, he would. He would just move you out the way with that big back. <laughs> <laughs> move you out the way with that big back and then jump hook. But I mean like Giannis be doing jump hooks and just dribble to the rim. And Shaq could put the ball on the floor too. I mean Giannis could put the ball on the floor. No, no, Giannis can run fast. <laughs> yo, yo. But running fast at seven foot. And the thing the way that people play Giannis, he could get speed. So cause Giannis can't shoot. Okay, so let's play him back. And he's still getting a bucket though. That's really you play crazy. Him back, he go right over you. Like it makes you play no sense. Him too close, he go right past you. Like I mean, if you don't, if you could do that, you might. You don't need no That's bag. He don't. You don't. He don't have no bag, but he don't really need it. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. He's the worst. But like he uses his abilities, like what he's good at, to the max potential. So I got to give him his respect for that. He's not a as far as skill wise, or talent wise, he hmm. is not top three to me. So you think KD's still number one? I ain't never said KD was who you, I mean, who do you believe is number one? I think KD might be number one. I think LeBron James is still the best player in the You think game. so? Mm-hmm. I think he's I think still I'm, the best player. I'm a little foggy because like he was hurt a lot this year. So it was just like, and at the in the playoffs, he was like, just like hobbling and shit, basically. Mm. So it's like, I feel like he's going to have a big year next year. And it's crazy to say that and the nigga is 38. Yo. It is really wild. Yo. I don't Yo. know what he's taking, but a million dollars is... Million dollars to fucking save his body. Honestly, like even Chris Paul don't get that proper respect. Like everybody say, yeah, Chris Paul's good, but look at how good he really is. Like Chris Paul is really good at basketball. Yeah. Like if you could put all these players, like you could put your favorite point guard, Stephen Curry, Damian Lillard, uh, uh, um, who else? Okay, name. Even LeBron, not LeBron. LeBron is OD. Uh, Russell Westbrook. Russell Westbrook. John Wall. Maybe not Westbrook because Westbrook could look he do it too. But just your favorite point guards, right? Even the young guys like De'Aaron Fox and shit. Like, and put them where Kyrie Irving as well. Yeah. Kyrie. And put them where Chris Paul has been for the last five years. So that's the OKC team. Rock, uh, that's the Rockets. Rockets. That's the Rockets team. And that's Suns. Uh, the Suns right now. Nobody except maybe Russell Westbrook would do what he's doing. You think Russell Westbrook could have brought them teams to the? He finals? did that with OKC. You can see, you think no, not to the finals, not to the finals. Oh, okay, the finals, okay. The but the way that because I'm just saying like the OKC like all the um the like the stocks not the, the not the stocks. Wait, the did you say Steph, wait? So if Steph Curry was on the Suns, you don't think they would have made the finals? No, I think they would have made the finals. Steph Curry and D-Book in the backcourt, that's kind of tough. Yeah, it is, scoring-wise. But, I mean... Who don't fry Steph Curry? <laughs> <laughs> Who doesn't fry Steph Curry? Bro, they got defenders to back him up. Chris Paul was that defender, so he didn't need that. And Chris Paul, if he had to, he's going to score that ball. And he's going to give all these people that don't give the looks the look. I'm not... Chris Paul... Not, not Chris Paul. Steph Curry, maybe. Steph Curry, maybe. You got to think about it. Chris Paul's like 35. Steph What's Curry's Steph, like, like 31? Like, yeah. 30? Like early 30s, probably. Yeah, early 30s. Maybe 32. 33 old. max. No, he's not 33. That's the max, I think. No, maybe 32. 32, 32 you max. You got Chris Paul's an old dude, bro. I know. Old as fuck. And he's doing what these young point guards can't do. But that's the that's that veteran mind. But the way that us fans and media look at it mm-hmm. is like, once you get 30, you're... you're Done. You know I mean? You're done. Now, past 35 is over. It's over. But you got to think about it. These people now have the experience, and they're wise as hell. And the science, mm-hmm. the, the recovery science is so much different. Like, now you can play till you're 40, but it's all whether you still have the love for the game or not. Of course. Like, but Vince like, Carter played till you're 40. That's what I'm saying. But Chris Paul is that guy. All right, so what's your top five point guards in the league right now? 
people call me crazy when I put Chris Paul in it, but Chris Paul is a top. I'm not in no order though. Chris Paul, Russell Westbrook, Stephen Curry, James Harden. You can't miss point. Yeah, James Harden is a point guard. Mm-hmm. And fifth is a weird spot. Would you say Kyrie? Kyrie no, Kyrie's a shooting guard. I don't care what nobody say. Kyrie's a shooting guard, so I'm not going to put. Um, LeBron James. If you want, can I put LeBron James there? I guess that's crazy. Well, LeBron James. If do I can put LeBron as a point guard, then yeah. What about Dame? I said Dame. Oh, you said Dame? Yeah. Who are you missing? I said Chris Paul, Dame Lillard, Russell Westbrook, Russell Westbrook, Steph Curry. Who are you missing? And James it's... Harden. No, I did, oh, I James Harden. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, yeah, James Harden. All right, that's that's a good five. That's a good five. But James Harden is a point guard. Nah, bro. he is. That boy is a point guard. He proved like. people wrong, bro. He t- he said they ain't gonna work with all these scores. He's like, nah, I'm yeah, good. I'm pass the ball. That's what I'm saying. Like, <laughs> I don't gotta do it. I can do it, but I don't have to. I don't have to throw it up. Like, let let them get a good like. They have a decent big. But he's young, so let them get like somebody seasoned. Isn't that that nigga we played two K with? Yeah, that's yeah, tough. Yeah, there's some, some Claxton. Yeah, I mean, let them get a uh, a big that could really catch it anywhere up there, like anywhere up there, and just throw it down. Yeah, because that nigga went from averaging thirty five. He's like, he's like, this not gonna work. Oh, you got three scores. He's like, all right. Even that, he was having an MVP caliber season. Oh, yeah, 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 he was. Until he got hurt. And everybody forgot about it once he got hurt. Mm-hmm. He so was averaging, what, like 29, you, like 11? When you put Giannis up there as top three. I don't know. He had a good performance in the finals. It was cute. You think, so you now, think he's the a... The only reason I don't bash Giannis is because he's African. <laughs> That's the only reason, man. What the... Because, you know what I'm saying, one Africa and all that, but... <laughs> <laughs> but if he wasn't, bro, niggas would hear me. <laughs> oh my god, niggas would hear me. Do you bro. think he's one of the top power forwards, like ever, ever? That list is like I'm talking about. The list isn't that big. Dirk, Karl Malone, Tim Duncan, uh, KG, and the re- and after that it's like I don't even know. So he might be five. So I'm saying the list isn't that crazy for power forwards, only for centers. And guards. Maybe small forward. Nah, small forwards. Is, small forward, LeBron right. is in a category by himself. And then Larry Bird or some shit. Larry Bird, Dominique Wilkins. Um, Pippen. Pippen, of course. That's what I'm saying. Like that. The list isn't really too big. For uh, forwards. Team worthy for forwards, but it's like. I mean. And the gap is crazy, though. So you go from like names like that to like James Worthy. Like Dr. J. Yeah. James Worthy. That's true. That's true. <laughs> so I was like, they not, no discredit to no, James Worthy. No like, disrespect to them niggas. Them niggas is nice. It's nice, but it's But like, they not compared to Larry Bird and yeah. all like LeBron. But I understand. But even, like, based on what I've seen, though. So, all right. All right so, st- is is Tracy McGrady a shooting guard or a small forward? I call that nigga, he a wing. I didn't even know you, Kevin Durant. Is he, he's a, so. He's like a wing. I'll put him at shooting guard. I don't care. A sw- that's a swing. A swing. Yeah, a swing, man. Guard, uh, so you put him at small forward? Like, it depends on the situation. So then what is James, uh, what not James, what is Vince Carter? The two. I feel like he's the two. I feel like he's the two? Yeah. So if, so if it's T-Mac and Vince Carter, I'll put him, like, on the wings. I feel like nowadays it's not even no position. It's just, no like, wings. point guard, wing, wing, bigs. Not oh. even. Point guard, wing, 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 big. Yeah. There's no, yeah. there's no power forward no more. Not even some of these bigs is coming down. Like, he. That's what he, I'm he. saying. Like them niggas like, is like small forwards taking now. Taking the ball coming down. Going, off. bro. Yeah. But hey, bro, I don't know. Oh, I got another thing. I have another segment. So, I'm a list. I'm gonna name you a couple players right now that didn't go to college. So say they were like in high school right now, like you, you know, and they're about to commit to college. What college do you think they're gonna go to, and what do you think their average is gonna be? Mm. All right. So LeBron James. Imagine LeBron was in high school right now. Like you remember when LeBron was in high school and shit? Mm-hmm. How like what college you think he would have went? Like what do you think his average would be? Uh, if he was in high school right now? Yeah, like going to college. He's about to go to college right now. Like when? I mean, honestly, because of COVID, I really don't know. Which oh wait, no is. COVID. Like, don't matter. That's what I'm saying. I don't know who's where. That's what I'm saying. So I don't know how like what school he would go to. That's I feel I mean. like, all right, after school, mm-hmm. just say what what you think he would average in in uh, college if he just. I think it's- <laughs> no, you think he getting thirty? Nah, I think he getting like KD numbers when he was a freshman. 
like 25. But LeBron I, do, hey, bro, LeBron's been doing it all, though. So I know. But he's gonna get like he 20. averaged 25 and 5 against grown men. Yeah. So imagine against... People his age, little kids his age. Like so he, it might be, I don't know. Because, I mean, KD went to the league. I think he averaged like, what, 20? Yeah. So I think maybe LeBron averaged like 25 in college. I say a solid 25, 7, and 5. How much does Zion average? 22. Same shit. You think so? They was doing... They was doing Young LeBron is doing the same thing LeBron was doing. I mean, Zion's doing. Zion's doing. Zion's doing yeah. That's respect. I was thinking about it like that too. Yeah, because literally running on that break because he faster than everybody and stronger than everybody. And you watch the highlights, mm-hmm. so you're not jumping with bro. That's true. If you jump with bro, you're an idiot. Like LeBron, if LeBron went to college, that'd be tough. That would be tough. You know how much publicity that nigga would get? But that's just publicity he made a good no decision. Money. I'm not gonna lie, bro. Publicity with no money. Exactly. He couldn't go to college. Cause if he would have went to college, he would got no money. Like he wouldn't, he wasn't able to go to college. He had to sign a, he had a shoe deal and shit. Like he wasn't able to do none of that shit. Like he had to go to the NBA. I felt like he had to. Yeah, for sure, for sure. That, that's why I'm happy. Times have changed now, type shit. So you could uh, get paid. In yeah, that's good because of the G League. Yo, you seen that uh, Master P son got like a two five, million, two million, bro? Like, was it like over four years or some shit? I know. Is he good? I mean, he looked he he look, kind of nice. He looked I. Right. Wait, pause. He. <laughs> that was kind of mook. I ain't gonna lie. He look. He don't look two million dollars worth. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm talking about his play though. Pause, got me. But like, <laughs> like his like. I'm talking about his uh play, play style. Now. I mean, I don't two know. million dollars. He's masterpiece, son. You know, he, his father probably like it's like, it's a project, a, a college guy. That, especially because it's COVID, so you don't really, really know, bro, who's gonna be elite at that level. I know. Now you could think like, oh, okay, he he did this the way he did this, the way he shot the ball, but you really don't know. That's facts. You don't know how to transition, bro. No. So giving somebody money without them stepping on the college floor, it's crazy. It's crazy. It really is, but you know, hey, but people around here got money to spend, bro. Rich people got money to spend. That probably they probably playing that shit. Mm-hmm. It's probably fake. All right, I got another guy, your favorite guy, T Mac. Mm. If you would have went to college, 40, 50, 45, you know, he would have chewed the boys up. <laughs> <laughs> I even know his Word. averages in the, his rookie year. I don't think, um, was it good? No, it, I think it was like average. No, it wasn't too good. He didn't play a lot. So I feel like in college, I feel like he would have been. I say I still, when the NBA was like, rookies are don't nothing. play. Rookies yeah. don't play. Rookies sit on the end of the bench. No matter. What you were drafted. That you makes could sense. You be a top 10 draft pick. You're a rookie. You're coming off the I know. Bench I think even Kobe sat on the bench a little yeah, bit. Yeah, Kobe sat on the bench too. Like, until you prove yourself, you are on the bench. That makes you sense. You could be getting numbers. They are putting you off the bench because this veteran is getting this. You feel me? That makes sense. Mm-hmm. But if you can guess, like, realistically, niggas talking about 40, 50 points for Tracy McGrady. 40, 50, word. But, um. I say a good 15, bro. 15 in college? Yeah, cause you know college is like systems uh, and shit. That was one of the that was one of the best scores, ever. But I see he wasn't as polished when he first got to the league. He was yeah. just like the like an athletic thing. Like, like D book averaging twenty five, and he in the college average like what nine? That's true. It's like it's just but a system. You could see what oh, D book had though. Like, I know, like Shea right in college, like you could just tell it was tell. way different. Same thing with De'Aaron Fox. Yeah, you could just tell like. He was so much faster than everybody else. Mm-hmm. Like, but like Shea, he he was coming off the bench in the beginning. Like he mm-hmm. wasn't even their best recruit. That's a fact. And then he started playing. He was like, oh nah, this nigga's nice, bro. Different. Like he, the game just easy. Yeah. Like that nigga's nice. Nah, he's he's, he's crazy. Talking. I wish he was on the fucking Knicks. Knicks, yeah, I wish everybody. Was on the Knicks. <laughs> I wish LeBron was on. The, I remember when LeBron was making that decision. Everybody, that's a Knicks fan, thought he was going to. Uh, that's what they always do, bro. It's the media. It is Times. What's that called? New York Times, bro. They be putting Lying. shit in our head, bro. It's not our fault. I'm trying to tell you, it's not Lying our fault. Up. Niggas talk about KD and Kyrie coming with Zion. Yeah. Like, what the hell? Happy. Like, are you serious, bro? First of all, I ain't forget, right? Oh, shit. You kept disrespecting my boy Zion. I know. I, I was disrespecting his knees. Bro, there's so much sports and recovery that the <laughs> knees are good. People's coming back from ACL tears, MCL, everything, MCM. 
TNA, WWE. They come, <laughs> they coming back from all the all the acronyms. They coming back. I know, but look, you see what happens after I bash them. They do great. They hear me. It happens all the time. I'm gonna oh, start bashing man. niggas on the Knicks. Maybe we win a championship. Shit, I don't know. It's yeah. like they hear my they yeah, hear my voice in their dreams. Would, I don't know. I don't even know if we're gonna be alive for a next championship. I hope. What? Ain't no way. <laughs> yeah, ain't no way in hell. I ain't gonna lie. I don't know if niggas we're gonna be alive niggas, for a next championship. Niggas said the same thing about the Bucks five years ago. That's true. Look That's at this true. shit. Who would have thought this? That's true. This I remember my dad had got from his job. He got free Bucks tickets. He got free Bucks and Nets tickets. And I did not want to go. I was like, <laughs> Nah, I ain't gonna lie. I did not want to. They go. used to give out free Nets tickets a lot, a lot, because it was, was so. <laughs> it was fucking it booty. Was so bad, bro. So they had to give it out for free. I remember I used to go to them Nets games. I didn't give a fuck. I went to like a Nets versus Grizzlies game. That's the ones that was giving out free. Hell yeah, the Grizzlies ain't have nobody. Nobody, bro. Right, I got another guy. This is a, this is a low key dude that might have went crazy. Tyson Chandler. Tyson Chandler is elite. You seen Tyson Chandler's mix in high school, bro? Tyson Chandler bro, is elite, he bro. pin cut shot off the top of the backboard. Yeah. Like, Tyson. top, top. Mm-hmm. Imagine Tyson that in college, bro. That's OD. But I feel like his NBA career would have been better. Would've he been. was still good Yeah. if he did go to college. Yeah. If I feel he, like if he didn't too. get polished in college. Mm-hmm. If he went to a really good school. If he would have went to, like. like started off better. Because mm-hmm. it ended off very good. Mm-hmm. Is he still in the league? Or he mm-hmm. retired? 41. I forgot. What he in 2K, nigga. though. So I think he just, like, just, just, like, retired. Maybe last year or didn't get picked up. That makes sense. But that that nigga in high school was jumping out the gym, bro. Yeah. Like, that was max. I'm saying 6'10", 6'11". Bro, he's 7'1". Se- oh, he's 7'1"? Yes, bro. Jumping. He was touching the top of the backboard, bro. Like, the corners. Yeah, that's crazy. Because seven-footers be all linky and slow and stupid. Exactly. So you he see was one that's athletic. And jumping like that. I'd be like, nah, Shit. he's 6'10". No way a seven-footer jumping like that. Hell no, bro. That's why I, believing that KD was seven-foot was crazy. That's He really had to lie about his height, though. Yeah, because I remember, right, there's this video on YouTube with, with KD and Michael Beasley. Mm-hmm. And they have uh, Michael Beasley, like, they have like a little caption under it. And they got Michael Beasley as, as a forward and KD as a shooting guard. Was this like the Rucker Park shit? It might have been the Rucker Park, but they're just talking, mm-hmm. and it was like uh, Kevin Durant, six eight, shooting guard. I know, and I'm like, niggas is shooting niggas guard. is two K players. That's what, life. <laughs> oh, that's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. It's Max, bro. Nah, whole time, bro. Like, and still, he still put down six ten. Like, it's crazy. Like he's I seven heard foot. LeBron sneaky six ten. I wouldn't be surprised. He's like six nine, maybe six ten with shoes on. Putting putting that he's six eight though that that's a big difference. Like why do people do that for the position, so you don't get labeled as a as a power forward. There's a reason why we looking at James Harden and saying you're not a point guard. But he's like because he's like six five. He's six five six six. But I mean, point guards are tall nowadays. You see Lonzo. Unless you starting at point guard and you've been a point guard your whole life, they're not going to jack you as a point guard. I guess, but I mean, like nowadays, I feel like. Back in the days, the height of the point guard was like 6'1", 6'2". Oh, yeah. you now that's just like 6'6". Six, six. You got to come in, play defense, and maybe knock down that open three. Mm-hmm. But your job, now point guards be... 6'6", 6'7", 6'7", and you better go get a bucket. Exactly. You better move the ball, too. Better run that. Play three. defense, too. Yeah, play defense, yeah. All right. Here's the last player. Kobe Bryant. He didn't go to college. He didn't need to. So a lot you, of these... The players that you're naming really didn't need to. But it's always it's always good to think like what if they went to college? I seen that on Instagram. I was like, that'd be tough. Like it was like KG and all the niggas. Like, what if they really what went to college? college? Like, what if Kobe went to like fucking um went to Duke? I don't know. I actually don't know. Like, what if type shit? I don't know. That'd be hard. Um, it would just he wouldn't be there for years though, so it wouldn't really matter. I mean, I guess. Like he would have been there like a one and done. Yeah. I feel like, like, one and done careers, unless you, like, got mellow career, one and done in the championship, don't matter. It's the people that stayed there for two, three years and put up numbers in their school that it really matters about yeah. what you did in college. But it makes sense to go one and done nowadays because, like... Well, it makes sense not to even go. I mean, now you don't have to go. Yeah, 
Now you can do the, the join the G League shit, the G League night. That overtime shit. Mm-hmm. So it's like you don't gotta go now. But back then, if you just want one year just to like go, but it's like, cause like they say if you stay longer, you're like wasting your prime. You are definitely. So it's like, that's why niggas don't draft seniors no more. Like Miles Powell was like, yeah, nigga was that's nice, crazy. bro. He didn't even get drafted. I don't think is he in the league right now. But even no, yeah, he's in, he played for the Westchester Knicks. Even that, like, was he on the summer league team? Summer league, yeah, not the D league team. Summer league. Was he on the summer league team? I don't. I ain't hear about him. I haven't heard about him in mad long. I know he. I know he was in a G league bubble. Yeah, but I don't know if he was in summer league. I That's don't remember. I don't think he would need to if he was already playing for uh, Westchester Knicks. Yeah, but like, I feel, I think after, I don't think a G League contract is like multiple years. I think it's like one year and then you got to switch teams. Nah, it depends on who you are. Yeah, but like. And if you, he, I think he had a two-way contract. I don't know. I can't remember. Because I remember he got, he got a two-way contract because he was on the Knicks roster. Yeah. And then got moved down. So he definitely had a two-way contract. I thought... But I think he went to the Bucks or some shit. I seen him with the Bucks uniform. I don't follow him. I don't know. I don't know, bro. I feel like niggas that come come from New Jersey go to the league. It's like the only nigga that really made is Kyrie for real. Yeah, bro. It's sad though because they be here and they be stars, bro. Nigga, remember Briscoe? That's what I'm saying. Star, like we like yo. He's going like. He gonna be the one type. Nah, shit. Nah, like, with Briscoe though, like I couldn't see him in the NBA going crazy. I don't know why. I could. I did. Like all, like all the the music jokes aside, like I really could see him because he could really score and yeah. defend. But I don't like, know. He's a really good defender. He, he just weird. He just. I got to think about it, like those guys right in the big three might be old, old as dirt. Yeah. But they still veterans and they still know. <laughs> they still mad strong. Like they, like they still hoopers. Yeah, they are. And he's going over there. And he's cooking them, like giving them buckets. He's locking up. Even though these are in shape veterans, though, it's not like the old. Like we saw when Gil was playing, Gilbert Arenas was playing. Yeah, watched. We saw what AI was playing. <laughs> Sorry to say that AI, my man, but AI was looking bad in the big three. Like he was in the big three. Yeah. When this season? Nah, the first, the first season. <laughs> really? I didn't yeah, even know that's that. How, that's what. That's one of the things they used to promote it. I've been, I've been, I'm in two with the big three, big time. I'm a big fan. Like, I've been watching. Is the season over? Yeah. Uh, Briscoe team just won. Really? I see he won, he won the fourth he man. He won the fourth man of the year. That's <laughs> what I'm saying. Like, he... There's some hoopers over there. Bro, shout out Ice Cube. Like, that's a tough yeah, athlete. Yeah. That's good. It's that's just, good I don't, it just needs to be uh, promoted a little more. I feel like he's going to get that. It's only, what, year three? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. That shit going to be on TV soon. They need, it is on TV. Oh, it is? Oh, right, he good, bro. It's on CBS. He good. He is but good. Nobody really be tuning in, tuning in. Like, I know what you mean. Like, I don't know nobody. It don't be on social media all that much. Yeah, uh, yo, you watched the last big three game? Niggas not doing that. I was watching the fucking, um, what's that shit? With the celebrities? I was watching that shit. I was tuning in to all of them. What? The That tournament with all the celebrities and shit. Oh, yeah, yeah. Because that's Crew League. They had, like, um, they had... Chris Brown. Chris, yeah, that shit. Because the reason, they they made it like a, like a show, kind of. Yeah. So they had people doing interviews. They had it was comedians, funny too, like comedians, like, like Drewski. It was it something drew you in. You wanted to see the way it was even edited, made you want to see what was going on. So yeah, that's true. That's the big difference. This is more real, like it more is like a real basketball. League. That's true.